What is space wave propagation? To understand space wave propagation, let's take an example of a badminton game. This game consists of players who stand facing each other, where one player hits a smash and the cork reaches the opponent. The main point of consideration is, the player should hit the cork in such a way that it reaches the opponent. That is, the cork must be directly in line of sight, where the opponent stands, otherwise the cork will go out of boundary and the opponent will not be able to revert. Similarly, space wave propagation will occur when the transmitting and receiving antennas are in direct line of sight. Thus, we can say that space wave propagation is defined as propagation in which space waves or radio waves travel directly from transmitting antenna to receiving antenna, where the antennas must be in the line of sight. Now, let's understand what space wave propagation actually is. It's basically a propagation technique which is capable of handling waves of higher frequencies where the waves are confined within the lower 20 km of the atmosphere. And because of this capability, it's used in bands such as VHF and UHF. The other name of space wave propagation is line of sight propagation owing to the fact that transmitting and receiving bodies must directly face each other. Line of sight is that distance at which both the sender and receiver are in sight of each other. Space waves are also known as radio waves only when latter has higher frequency. Like we all know, any propagation has certain advantages and disadvantages, and so does space wave propagation has. Space waves reflect off hard objects and may be blocked if the object is between the transmitter and receiver. The other limitation includes these waves are limited to the curvature of the earth and even bends if the waves have lower frequency. The related term is 